direction. Now, same old direction for a Buffalo Bills in the playoffs. Oh, man. Now, Patrick Mahomes is obviously Patrick Mahomes. And Travis yep. Kelsey, <laughs> guess who's back in the paint, baby? Who's yeah. that? All eyes on me, he said. And he mm -hmm. gets two touchdowns in Buffalo with the most amount of audience that they've had all year. Now, obviously, he's wide open here, and this was beautifully crafted, and Travis Kelsey throws it in his stand and said, take that. You throw snowball, I throw pigskin. Then he gets another one. Knee almost done. It was close. Almost, almost done. Almost. But it's Travis Kelsey he gets in the end zone, obviously, good Ohio boy. And I, don't, I think it's safe to say that the Kelsey brothers owned Buffalo last year. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay, Jason Kelsey was obviously a phenomenal superstar in the crowd. Wow. I believe he was in the Taylor Swift suite, which was also the Mahomes suite, yep. which was also the Kelsey suite, mm -hmm. which means that whole place was having a great time in Buffalo. Nobody was having a better time than this man. Wow. Congrats on retirement, Jason. Yeah. Let's go. This, this video obviously followed the, the video of him out with Bill's Mafia drinking out of a bowling ball and mm -hmm. walking through the parking lot and some Tims and some sweats having mm -hmm. the time of his life watching his brother do his thing. But immediately after the big Yeti yell after Travis Kelsey's touchdown, he does some of the most athletic shit that I've seen in some time from any human in Tim's. Remember, he's like 285, 290 pounds. Mm -hmm. Has played 19 games. He's 36 years old. It's freezing cold. Doesn't even look down. He almost slips Whoa. and falls right there. Whoa. Okay, that's almost busted head. Instead, freak Superhero athlete. Landing. Let me save myself. Gives a dap up. Finishes the beer. Probably his first one, right? Yeah, probably his first beer. Yeah, look at, explode right back up there. It goes up to that guy's shoulder. Look where the... It's on that guy's shoulder is how high that is. Doesn't bang his knee. No. Nope. Doesn't do it. Levitates his big ass back up into the suite having a time of his life. Good for Chiefs fans having fun. Yeah. yeah. Incredible. Now, I will say, look at this. Look at this. World-class athlete. Boom. Legit. Explosion. Fit. It's, it's January 21st. He's had a full season. He's 36 years old. Yeah. We see him on the field. Mm -hmm. You know, he's got the knees and the ankles mm -hmm. and everything, literally, after the career that he's had. And I assume not. he didn't have any tour at all, but he ended up boozing him. Oh, yeah. You know, he woke up this morning thinking to himself, oh, what happened? Wow. Mm -hmm. Kylie, what I? We must have oh, won. Yeah. Kylie, I was... Why'd you let me do that? Why'd you let me do that? Why'd you let me jump out there? Boom! Up and over there. And I saw a couple people say, any athlete could do that. I'm like, what? okay. In Tim Sweats, hammered, drunk, 36 years old. Yeah. Very impressive. People hate the Chiefs, though. Hate they them. they hate the Chiefs. I did not know this. Oh, yeah. I did not, I did oh, not know that yeah. this was the case. The Chiefs is the Chiefs, and we need to remember that the Chiefs is the Chiefs. But they are at the top of the mountain and have been. Mm -hmm. And anytime you're at the top of the mountain, obviously people throw rocks at things that shine. Shout out to Taylor, Taylor Swift, Swift, who has joined them at the top of the mountain. You're going to get a lot of haters. I think what the Buffalo Bills have accomplished this year was phenomenal. I think they got hot at the right time. I think they played great football, great football down the stretch. I think they were a fun team. We're very mm -hmm. thankful for the Buffalo Bills joining us on this particular program. Both Mitch Morse, who James Cook was just cooking right up the middle mm -hmm. yep. of that Chiefs defense, and he was Mitch Morse moving his big-ass body, mm -hmm. and he's electrifying. Jordan Boyer, big-time punch-out down Ooh, near the end zone huge. to cause a touchback. Good rule. Yeah. 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 Those are the rules. What are we even... Pipe down about it. Honestly, I, I don't even know how that's become Protect a thing. the ball. Yeah, the, Boom, you saw Kelsey. This is a territorial football game. Okay, that's what uh, that's what football is. That's our end zone. Okay, we're gonna keep you out of it. We're gonna try to get to your end zone down there. When we can't, we'll try to gain territory. We'll punt it back to you. Now we're gonna defend our turf. If our end zone ends up with the ball, guess what? Our ball. Mm -hmm. That is how this whole thing goes. You just got to be careful with the rock. Now, McCole Hardman had a tough one yesterday. They still get the win, so he lives to see another day. Good for him. MVS has a massive day. Yeah. But the Bills, the Bills is the Bills. Congrats to the Bills. Tough ending for another season. Uh -huh. Yeah. Very tough ending for another At season. At home. Yeah. I mean, it's just like when Peyton had run in Tom Brady, Bill Belichick for all those years. Bingo. Yeah, exactly. Now, like, Josh Allen's got to deal with Patrick Mahomes, Andy Reid, yeah. mm -hmm. Travis Kelsey, and Jason Kelsey blacked out drunk in the crowd. Bingo. I mean, there's a lot of things working against him all the time. Josh Allen's stats. Okay, let's get into this. Yeah. Josh Allen has been eliminated by Kansas City three times in the playoffs. 2020, 2021, and now 2023. In those three playoff runs, 306 yards per game, okay. total offense, 22 touchdowns, mm. one turnover. Jesus. What? Over three. 